Hello dear students of class 4 as we were dealing with chapter 6 as you can refer to page number 51 and the topic that we were dealing was plants in the surrounding and environment right and last video in the last in the previous video we have discussed about the parts of plant and we also uh, we also have uh, we have discussed about the root system of the plant and you already know the functions of roots but still I want to review or recall whatever we have learned in the previous class okay as we know the root system about the root system the main function of the root is to keep the plant in a particular place secondly root uh, protect the soil from erosion and we also came to learn, came to know about the types of roots that are found in the various type of plants. And the main function of the root is to supply the water and minerals from the stem to the leaves. And, and in some of the plants, there are roots which store food, such as potato, radish, and, and radish swan. So today we are going to deal with the soot system of the plant. In the soot system, uh, these are the parts that is whatever that is that are found above the ground surface. Whatever is found or whatever is visible are known to be as a soot system. So in the soot system, mainly we can see stem, okay, stem or stem or stems of the plants flowers, leaves, uh, fruits, buds. So, what is the, so when we talk about the stem of the plant, stem, uh, the main function of the stem is to keep the plant, uh, to give a support to the plant and to keep the plant straight and upright. Okay? Before we discuss about the function, let us know about the stem okay stem is connected to the roots and from the stem and from uh, with the stem the other parts of the trees are connected such as branches leaves fruits flowers etc and and in stem either the stem can be a harder and a stronger one or can be soft one or can be a weak one in cases of the plants that we trees the big trees the stems are very strong and the strong stems we are known as trunk and in the cases of like herbaceous plant okay herbaceous plant uh, and in a creeper and a climber the stems are not strong as compared to the strong trees so these are the this is about the stems and what are the functions of the stems firstly stems keeps the plant uh, it supports the plant uh, supports the plant support the plant to stand straight and upright and secondly plant this is the stem the stems supplies the water and mineral from the root to the leaves and the third function of the stem is when the food is prepared by the leaves the food is supplied from the stem to the different part of the plants and some of in some in some plants we can see that even the stem also stores food such as sugarcane sweet potatoes okay so these are some examples so these are the this was the functions of the stem now we we move on to the leaves okay in your previous class that is in class 3 you have learned about the structures of the leaf as we know that leaf produces food by the process of photosynthesis before moving on uh, before we talk about leaf, uh, about the function of the leaves let us discuss the structure of the leaf as we can compare from the diagram that I has made so I have brought the sample of the leaf and you can see the leaf here and so this is the 
starting point from where the leaf starts as this this part we call it petiole is connected to the branch of the tree and this petiole is connected to the branch and from whatever the minerals is brought from the root is supplied to the petiole to the leaves and you can see this part is known as leaf blade or lamina okay and it is broad and flat and uh, you can see the you can see the you can view it and the main from here when the, the main the main vein or the central vein of the leaf it was it is also known as midrib okay so this midrib it connects the petiole and from here okay so many other veins it runs from the central vein and in, it makes a channel in which the mineral is supplied mineral and water is supplied throughout the leaves and you can see the leaves or maximum of the leaves in the plant you can see they are in green in color this is because of the presence of chlorophyll okay the presence of chlorophyll makes the color to be in green in color so what is the function of chlorophyll when the with this green color in a simple in a simple way we can say when the leaves have the green color this green due to the green color it observes sunlight okay so this was the structure of the this was what uh, we have we have already known that uh, we have learned the structure of the leaf in the previous class also so let us move on to the function of leaf what is the main function of the leaf as we already know that leaf is known as food factories of the plant or we can say kitchen of plant where food is produced or where food is made through the process of photosynthesis as when the leaf leaf observes or it takes it, it takes carbon dioxide with combination with water and and with the help of the sunlight and chlorophyll the food is produced in the leaf and afterwards when the food is prepared it is passed through the stem to the different part of the body and we can make out that food that is made or uh, that is food that is prepared is none other by the leaf itself for the plants and the second function of the leaf is that it has got so many let me uh, as the food is produced okay that the second function as the food food is produced with the help of photosynthesis that is glucose or sugar and when the when the food is supplied to different part of the plants okay the, the extra extra food is stored as a starch and the main thing is that in this leaf there are so many uh, minute or small holes that is specially found in the uh, the back side of the leaf or the bottom side of the leaf that is mainly for transpiration or for exchanging of gas and what helps then what what is the what do you mean by transpiration transpiration is a process of giving off uh, water okay from the stomata from the small pores of the leaf in order to in order to in order to to take the carbon dioxide as well as to remove the water vapor in to remove the water in the form of vapor and when it is, when transpiration takes place what happens it helps the leaves or the plants to cool down so this is also one of the function and in some of the cases in some of the plants we can see even leaves also store food such as lettuce and in spinach yes these are the function of leaves so my dear children so it is our it is our duty to plant okay and support uh, afforestation instead of doing uh, this one cutting down the trees and supporting deforestation okay so we already know that plant is very essential in our day-to-day -day life as it provides so many things okay so many things be it be a food that is that we get food from the plants right and 
So as for the food, when we talk about food, uh, starting from the pulses, pulses, vegetable, fruits, oil, and even the beverages such as tea and coffee, we get it from the plant. See how essential is plant for us. The plant, and as we, when we, and not only that, it provides food. And there are so many plants that are that has a got a medicinal values, which is very important for to make uh, this medicine. Even some plants such as cotton, cotton, okay, cotton, jute, so on. They provide fiber, you know, to make clothes and bags. So, uh, such as there are so many varieties of plants with so many uh, with so many values, which is very important, and it comes in the use of uh, mankind. So, my dear children, this where the in the previous chapter and this chapter was all about plants, and you have learned so many facts about the uh, plants. So, what I suggest is go through the book. And since there are so many illustrative illustrations, okay, the pictures are there, so many examples are given. So through that you can learn more about about the chapter and you can even explore about the chapter. Okay. So what I do want you all to try to solve the the short question answers by yourself and we will and the answers will be given afterwards though. So, till then, take care, keep studying. Thank you.